Most Reverend Father, the parish of the Most Holy Rosary requests you to crown the image of Our Lady of the Most Holy Rosary of Kalmai. Let the mandate be read. Please stand. Decree for the greater glory of God and the salvation of souls to foment devotion to the Holy Mother of God is one of the most efficacious ways to grow in Christian piety and discipleship. Our predecessor in the Sea of Linge and Agupan, the most Reverend Mariano Madriaga saw that it was the faith and devotion of the Catholic faithful in Kalmai to the Holy Mother of God that inspired the devotion of the Catholic that inspired some people to build a chapel under her patronage with the title Virgen del Santísimo Rosario. Such was the steady growth of faith in the Catholic Church by those who revered the Virgin Mary of the Most Holy Rosary, that on the 21st of January, in the year of the Lord, 1973, my revered predecessor, in the exercise of his ecclesiastical powers and in re recognition of the spiritual fervor of the people established the new parish of Our Lady of the Most Holy Rosary. We have received with pleasure the petition of the pastor of the said parish, Father Roy Joel Rosal, in consultation with the lay leaders within the parochial jurisdiction. In a letter dated the 3rd of July, 2023 that the image of Our Lady of the Most Holy Rosary with the image of the child Jesus venerated in the said parish be adorned with a crown of precious jewels as an act of devotion and reverence. With the consent of the College of Consultors we hereby decree that for the greater glory of God and the edification of the people of God, the image of Our Lady of the Most Holy Rosary and the Child Jesus in the parish church in Kalmai, the Gupan city, be crowned with precious jewels in our name as an, as an act of piety and religious ardor. We admonished the Catholic faithful who will visit and pay homage to the crowned image of the Virgin Mary and the Christ child to pray for the preservation of the Catholic faith in the sea of Linge and Dagupan and plead to God for the increase of vocations to the ordained ministry and consecrated life. From the Cathedral of St. John the Evangelist the Gupan City, this 25th day of July, Feast of the Apostle James, in the year of the Lord, 2023. Signed, Socrates B. Villegas, Archbishop of Lingian the Gupan.
Bless the Lord God of heaven and earth. Bring your mercy and justice. You cast down the mighty and exalt the lowly. Your marvelous wisdom is shown above all in the Word made flesh and in His Virgin Mother. For He, your Son, who freely humbled Himself, even unto death on the cross, now sits at your right hand and is radiant with unending glory, the King of kings and Lord of lords. And she, the Virgin, who wished to be called your servant, was singled out to be the mother of the Redeemer and true mother of all the living. Now she is exalted above the choirs of angels and raised in glory with her Son, praying for all of us, the Queen of Mercy, pleading for grace. Merciful Lord, look upon your servants, who by crowning this image of Christ your Son and his Mother, proclaim him as King of all creation and approach her as our Queen. Give us the grace to follow them in serving you, to do what love demands for the sake of our brothers and sisters, to deny ourselves and spend ourselves so as to win our neighbors for you, to be lowly on earth so as to be exalted in heaven, for you reward your faithful servants with the crown of life. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen.